have either of you guys had this kind of experience where you see somebody that maybe you had that kind of, that you have for him in this film that you're like, oh, right. I just want to just touch you type of thing? <laughs> I mean, of course, there's, you know, everybody has, has uh, someone that they looked up to at some point in high school. Right? Yeah. Or, or, or just in life, you know, celebrities that you think are just like... Be good the, to be that guy. Yeah, it, the people that you want to be. Yeah. Not just people that you want to hang out with, but like people that you wish you kind of were. You want their life. Or yeah. Right. yeah, everyone's got that. Well, except for you, because you are that guy to everyone. I mean, oh. You're just cool, man. Me? Yes. Me in real life or yeah. me the character? Both, man. No, yeah. even that guy. Yes. Even that guy. Anybody you can think of, you ask them, do you have... They have who? somebody. It's called influences. Like, who, yeah. who, who, yeah. Do you, who do you dig? Yeah. Well, who, yeah. Who, who, who was your, who was your influence that inspired you growing up? Uh, actors? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I always loved, like, the old, mo like... The Paul Newmans and the, the Cary Grants and, you know, those kind of guys that could do anything, they right? do like drama and comedy and seem like normal guys outside of the Hollywood BS. You've been doing these really cool, morally fucked up cult characters like yeah. this and Bernie. What is it for you? Why are you taking on these types of characters? And what draws you to it? Uh, I just, I, you know, I've been uh, drawn to, to the darker uh, comedies for a while now and, and it's just uh, more interesting to me. I've seen and been in so many uh, sort of uh, straight ahead uh, storytelling comedies that it, it's uh, refreshing to me not only to read them but to make these uh, movies that, that have a darker edge. You start off kind of as the teen heartthrob, you did all, and you, was it hard for you to, because you're really fucking good at comedy. Oh, that's, I, I will never get tired of hearing that. That's very nice of you yeah, to say. How, was Thank it hard you. to get into that? Or? Uh, well, I mean, it's, I feel like there's always an education, like you, you uh, an education of like, like showing people, getting the opportunities to show people different facets of yourself or whatever. I, I you know, yeah, I started doing <clears throat> some of those teen scream movies or whatever, and uh, because you like, you're, you need a job, <laughs> like it's, you take any opportunity to act, period. And, um, but yeah, I always wanted, I always loved comedy. I was, in high school, I was always doing comedies, I was always working on some goofy accent or doing different voices, and my dream was to be on SNL. Really? Was to be like a, like a regular on the show. And uh, yeah, and so a few opportunities came up and I was just drawn to them because it was like, a, you know, you're always looking for something to, show some different side of yourself. So um, it's fun when you get people like yourself saying that you know, you're, you're good at it and it's fun to watch you doing it.